It is chilly, it's snowing, the goats are hungry, and I'm going to show you how to use and get free winter food for your goats. So let's check it out. Christmas trees. You can use old Christmas trees for free winter forage for your goats. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and feed the goats one of these trees, a smaller tree. Um, we're gonna check out, see how they enjoy it, but then stay tuned. I'm gonna tell you a couple things to keep in mind, some precautions. <laughs> but some benefits is it's free. It mixes up their food source. It provides vitamins and minerals. Pine trees are high in uh, vitamin A, and that's great for your goats. But let's go ahead and see how the goats enjoy it, and then I'm gonna tell you a few things to look out for if you do feed your goats Christmas trees. <laughs> As you can see, the goats really enjoy having a nice treat. And it's more than a treat, it's winter forage. This is of course not their main food. Even in the winter time, we have our goats on about maybe a half acre or so. Um, there's lots of down trees and old firewood that I need to clean up. But this used to be forest or the edge of a forest and I, I took down a lot of the trees to make a goat area. Um, we also put them in the front pasture so they have plenty of food even in the winter time but there are some precautions with christmas trees one with any food you don't want to feed excessive amounts especially at first you don't want to radically change your goat's diet that could be bad um, so i just feed them a little bit at a time um, this is their second or third christmas tree and at first I just gave them a few branches. The second Christmas tree um, that was in the video, I'm actually gonna toss in my garden, which is fenced in. That's gonna keep it away from the goats and our horses. Um, goats are able to, to, uh, to uh, digest the pine needles, but horses aren't. But of course, horses aren't really gonna go crazy for it. Cattle, there's problems with cattle eating pine, so I would stay away from that. But goats seem to be great with it. I've been feeding my goats Christmas trees for the last couple years, just as treats again and kind of to supplement their diet. Another precaution is try to get organic Christmas trees that aren't sprayed. And some uh, Christmas tree companies spray, it's like a fire retardant chemical. Uh, but hey, if your Christmas tree catches on fire, that would be a scary thing inside your house. So I don't even know if that chemical really works that well, but who knows. But luckily, I live near what some people would call the Christmas tree capital of America in the mountains of North Carolina. I believe the Christmas tree that went to the White House this year came from about 45 minutes away from me. So we have lots of Christmas tree farms. You can ask your friends for old Christmas trees. Lots of areas have, um, I guess, Christmas tree drop-off places. Um, 
there are places to find Christmas trees. Just try to get a, an organic tree so that you're not giving your goats dangerous chemicals. But again, this is a free source of food and I've been doing it for the last several years. My goats love it, they really enjoy it, and they're happy, especially in the winter when there really isn't a lot of forage out. So until next time, I hope this uh, was beneficial to you and uh, enjoy your warm houses because uh, it's chilly where I'm at right now. <laughs>